Hi, so today I'll show you how to do a shawl. This is uh, a project that my sister has been working on for three years. It consists of uh, looming. So first, um, to do this uh, shawl, you'll need a loom needle and some yarn, about 300 grams. So you'll make a knot like she does right now. Then, then um, you'll have to start going around those uh, pegs and like so until the end. Then you'll have to secure your yarn so you can do your next manipulation which will consist of pushing down the yarn so we can do another layer of um, about well another rope actually so now you'll have to take back your yarn first you're gonna go straight down to the peg in front of the one the original one and then you'll have to go around the first peg. Then, after this, you'll start again to uh, go around the pegs and you'll form an X with the row below. Now I turn the camera around to give you a better view. So it's like if, um, you were, you were knitting your shawl just right in front of you. So for this next step, it's really easy. You'll have to uh, bring the first loop over the second loop. So the one nearest to the bottom of the loom. And make sure to let go the loop so you'll only have one loop left on each peg. So as I said, this project took my sister three years to finish. So it's a really long project compared to my other projects, but um, I mean, it's really worth it because the product you'll get in the end will be really nice and, it's gonna, and it can be a great gift for anyone. Especially in the winters, um, I mean, when it's really cold outside, um, you can wear this outside with your coat or even inside to warm up next to the fireplace. So basically, you'll just have to continue what I've been showing you at the beginning uh, many, many times. And, um, and uh, once it's long enough, I'll show you soon how to um, cast off those stitches. If you ever tried this project, I would really like to know how yours turned out, so just leave a comment down below and you'll make my day. So if anybody's wondering, this pattern for this shawl is actually a cross stock knit stitch. I think it's one of the easiest uh, pattern out there. So once it's long enough for you, we're going to bind off. So basically the technique for this is um, you'll have to take the first loop and bring it over to uh, the peg just in front of it. And you'll have to um, take the loop that was in, on the peg um, under the loop you brought to the peg. I hope what I'm saying here is clear, but you'll see in a few seconds more clearly what I'm talking about. And then you continue um, this step 
over and over until the end of the room. And also make sure to let the old loop, meaning um, the one that you brought to the peg, uh, let it free. So don't worry about it. That's how you have to do it. So as you can see here, I'm bringing the loop that was on the peg under the loop that I brought to the peg. And I forgot to mention, you can actually purchase these um, looms at Walmart. It's really easy to find them. The last loop, you'll have to um, actually make it wider, then cut your yarn. and pass the thread through the last loop and by doing so you'll make a knot and voila we're done So thank you a lot for watching and if you enjoyed this video please click on the thumbs up button and you can even subscribe to be notified of my future videos. Thank you. Bye.